Welcome to the health app creation. In this first video, we will cover four topics. The basic settings, the prototype settings, the membership creation, and the pop-up feature. Let's start with the basic settings. On the maker page in the app basic settings, you can change the app ID, app name, app icon, and splash screen. Don't forget to double check your app ID. Click on the default icon to open the icon upload settings. Click on the upload button to upload the image and then click on the apply button to set it. Repeat the same procedure with the splash screen. If you wish to delete the image, first click on the image, then delete it. Only then you can be able to upload a new image. Once you are satisfied with your basic settings, then move on to design team settings. In the design team, you can select the prototype menu for your app. Here, I've selected the drop-down menu for the app. In the color settings, you can select the colors of your app design. The first color is for the header, the second for the menu, and the third for the text of your app. Once you're satisfied with your changes, click on the save button. Now, let's explore the membership app settings. On the manager page, go to service, and click on the subscription settings. Click on the add subscription policy to open the membership app settings. Choose private available after registration option. Then write the introduction message and app policy. Once you are satisfied with the changes, click on the save button. Now to set up the pop-up screen for our app, go to the manager page. Go to service and click on pop-up. Here you can select any pop-up screen type for your app. To activate the pop-up, just click on the pop-up checkbox. Now, click anywhere on the screen to upload the pop-up image. Click on the link wizard button to link your pop-up with any feature or service. Here I've linked the pop-up with our user page. Click on apply link button to set the link. Then click on save to apply the changes. This is how our pop-up screen will appear when users open the app. Users can choose to close the pop-up or to open it. In case user click on the pop-up, he will get redirected to the linked screen. When users will exit the pop-up link screen, he'll see the login screen. Users will only get access to the app after they sign up. 